Hello, my name is Jesus Eddie Campa, Chief of Police for the Marshall Police Department, and I need your help in solving the murder of Edgar Dawson, who was a Marshall resident. He graduated from Marshall High School. Edgar Dawson was well known in the community because of his love of cars. On February 21st of 1997, Edgar Dawson was sitting in his car, uh, joined by some friends, parked in the, in the driveway of a home. He was in the passenger seat of the vehicle and they were just hanging out, just listening to music, having a good time, and somebody decides to fire a shotgun in their direction, hitting Mr. Dawson in the chest, instantaneously killing him. We did a canvas of the area. We talked to, to the people he was with. We talked to the neighbors. Nobody saw anything. We don't have any information at this time whether or not there was some kind of retaliation or some kind of a personal vendetta or whether he had any sort of enemies. We don't know if it's drug related, if it's gang related. We do know that it was not a robbery attempt. This appears to be some kind of random act. I know we're not given a whole lot because we don't have a whole lot. Somebody did see a white vehicle. Uh, we were able to track down that vehicle. We, we made contact with these individuals, but we can't tie it completely into the case. Whether it be the shooter or his friends or the neighbor who just happened to be looking outside and saw this, we need somebody to come forward and just give us that final piece of evidence that we can put this individual behind bars. There's this cliche of snitches end up in ditches. Law enforcement, we're here to protect you. We're here to serve you. And we'd like to bring closure to everybody in anybody's case. The Marshall Police Department has partnered up with the FBI's East uh, Texas Violent Task Force in providing a $10,000 reward. You can contact our office here at 903-935-4575 or you can contact us at 903-935-9969. Your identity will remain anonymous. The community has played a big role in Marshall, Texas in helping us solve crime. So the community there is vital. When we know that the community knows something, we're asking that, that one person who's holding that little piece of evidence to please come forward and help us bring closure for the family, bring closure to the officers who have spent over 10 years working on this case and bring the people who committed this crime to justice.